Good morning, madam. My name is Shiva. I am from Phase Six. Our project is called Spotter. My role in this project is project design. Good morning, my neighbor. My name is Amesh. Our project is Power Spotter. My role in this project is project manager. Good morning, my neighbor. My name is P. My neighbor. And my role in the project is to test the to test the tester and make changes in it. Good morning, my neighbor. Our project name is Power Spotter. My role in this project is resource management. My name is Deepika. Our project is Power Spotter. My role in this project is project management. First of all, I would like to thank our project head, Mr. G. Kathiraji sir, and Mr. B. Vikrashwara sir, and Mr. B. Kondam sir. And the main object of our project is to test the current flow in a conductor, and it is very efficient and effective. Existing features, clamp tester and electric tester also used to test electricity. It is totally work with physical contact. Plant tester is more expensive. Identification of a problem. When we test electricity with an electric tester, it may cause electric shocks due to the tester failure. Plant tester also used for the testing the electricity, but it is expensive. There are two existing solutions. As we know that there are two existing devices, the normal tester and the clamp tester. By using normal tester for testing the clamp flow in a wire. We need to remove the insulation and we need to be in contact with the, uh, the main conductor inside the wire. So it is also a disadvantage. There is a time tester and it is hard to do that. And by using uh, clamp, clamp tester, we need to make we know we need to make the wire inside the box and and its uh, cost also is very expensive. And by that, by, by removing all this, we made a simple detector which makes the sound and shows the going of the LED simply and effectively. The main disadvantages of using a normal tester is that we need to, uh, if we want to test the electricity, we need to make the main, main conductor in contact with this. So, uh, whenever internal solenoid is raised, it may get shocked for us. So we made a uh, solution for this problem, which is helping with different shops and on contact and easy to carry and get to open it. Material requires for our project is DC 556 transistor, 100 kilo ohms resistor, LED of 5 volts, buzzer of 5 volts, battery of 9 volts, and battery connecting wire, breadboard, copper wire, and electrical wires. We should be easy. DC 556 transistor, the transistor that you use to pass it in. So here we can see the working of our business model and we will see. You can hear the buzzing sound. When we switch off the switch, it will stop. When we switch on, it will make the sound. So in this way we can detect the current.